The maximum charging capacity of a notebook battery decreases over time, causing the battery to lose its ability to accurately gauge its true charge capacity. Calibrating a battery resets the battery gauge and ensures the battery recharges completely. This video shows two methods for automatically testing and calibrating the battery, as well as a method for manually calibrating the battery. HP System Diagnostics is a useful tool for testing and calibrating the battery. To begin, disconnect the power cord from the notebook. Then, turn off the notebook. Wait a couple of seconds and turn the notebook back on. Immediately press the Escape key and repeatedly press it. When the Startup menu opens, select System Diagnostics by pressing the F2 key. When the HP PC Hardware Diagnostics UEFI window opens, click the Battery Test button. The Battery Test window opens and shows the amount of time for the battery test and the estimated time for the battery to be calibrated. Click the Start Battery Test button. When the battery test is complete, a window opens showing the test results. In this example, the battery passed the test, and you do not need to take any action. If the system detects a problem, a brief solution for the problem, such as Calibrate or Replace, shows here. Follow the on-screen instructions to resolve the problem. HP Support Assistant is another tool for testing and calibrating the battery. Start by typing HP Support Assistant on the Start screen. Select HP Support Assistant from the results list. When HP Support Assistant opens, click the Battery and Performance box. Click the HP Battery Check button. A Test in Progress screen opens and displays until the test is complete. Then the Results screen opens. In this example, the battery status is OK. If the HP Support Assistant detects a problem, a brief solution to the problem, such as Calibrate or Replace, shows here. Follow the on-screen instructions to resolve the problem. You can also manually calibrate your notebook battery. During the manual calibration cycle, the battery must be completely charged, completely discharged, and then recharged again. With the power adapter connected to the notebook, allow the battery to charge until the level reaches 100%. After the battery is fully charged, you need to drain it completely. To do this, turn the notebook off and disconnect the power cord. Press the power button to turn on the notebook. Immediately press the escape key and repeatedly press it. When the startup menu opens, select System Diagnostics by pressing the F2 key. Running the hard disk test is a good way to completely drain the battery. Click Hard Disk Test and click the Start Hard Drive Test button. Then click Extensive Check. Leave the notebook on until it shuts down from lack of battery power. Next, you will need to completely recharge the battery. Connect the power cord to the notebook and turn on the notebook. When the charge level reaches 100%, leave the power cord connected for at least three hours. To verify the battery is properly calibrated, run a battery test. With the power cord still connected, turn the notebook power off. Wait a few seconds and turn the power back on. Immediately press the Escape key and repeatedly press it. When the Startup menu opens, 
Select System Diagnostics by pressing the F2 key. Select Battery Test. Click the Start Battery Test button. When the test is complete, the battery test shows the calibration status as passed. If the battery status shows Calibrate, try calibrating the battery again. If the battery still doesn't calibrate, it might need to be replaced. You can find additional helpful videos at hp.com slash support videos and on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash how to for you.